If I think about the last four years of Trump being president. The virus will not have a chance. As an American living outside of the country, I feel you are fake news. embarrassed. Uh, I feel ashamed. Je dirais plutôt c'est un succès. Pourquoi? Il a tenu ses promesses. We have the best economy. Les quatre dernières années de la présidence de Trump ont été un cauchemar ininterrompu. I think he's been very successful with his goals. Although they're similar in age, I think if you look at their vitality, there's quite a big difference. You know, the rapidly rising uh, um, uh, in with, uh, with uh, I don't know. Uh, it's true that it is disappointing that that's where we came to. La politique est souvent la, le choix entre le mauvais et le pire. Mais cette fois-ci, je ne suis pas tout à fait d'accord avec ça. When I think about this idea of all Americans, um, we hear about Trump talking about America first, and he and he really tries to get everyone motivated around this idea of all Americans. But now we're finally protecting our nation, rebuilding our cities. But everything that we've seen is it's not America first; it's whatever Trump thinks that day. Je crois c'est pas possible parce que il y a toujours cette split 50-50 uh, dans les mentalités américaines. Joe Biden. Absolument, il l'a dit, il l'a dit pas plus tard qu'hier. I work for those who vote against me as hard as those who voted for me. That's the job of a president, to heal. Trump should have been uh, the president for everyone, but the Democrats never accepted his election. So I, for me, it would be whoever's elected should be and will be the president for all. The Radical question, left. Will you shut your, up, man? Listen, who is on your list, Joe? This who's is on your so list? right, gentlemen. This is, I think this we've is ended so this. He's going to pack the court. We have been oh, no, not no. going to give up. Oh, je j'en ai, je l'ai vécu le temps de dix minutes avant d'éteindre la télé. We could be doing such great things, and instead we're talking about how you know. Trump won't stop interrupting and how he won't stop talking about himself and how he's so rude, and that's a shame. It's hard to get any word in with this clown. Excuse me, this Hey, hey this let me person. just say to you. No, 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 I'm no. Mr. President. Three and I'm a half Mr. Million. President. Biden was the one who started the interruptions, and that's his modus operandi. He did that against Paul Ryan in 2012. So uh, Trump had to put an end to it. So I, I, I'm not happy about it, but Trump did what he had to do. No, à mon avis, non. Parce que le populisme, c'est une réaction qui prend ses racines dans les deux côtés. Je le souhaite ardemment. But every generation has moved closer and closer and closer to inclusion. It's the first one, elected president, to deliberately try to turn it back. No, not at all. I think it will it long continue past uh, the end of Trump's term. Changing the, the president is of utmost importance, but it doesn't fix everything. And, and that's up to the rest of Americans to really take on and do um, to, to put some of that to rest.